I'm Pat Green, president of Cascade Die Casting Group. We have plants in Michigan and North Carolina. We currently have two Strico stack melters that we utilize in the Michigan aluminum plant. And in that plant, we melt approximately 8 million pounds of metal a year. And, uh, and these two Strico melters are probably about 60% utilized. We initially had one melter and uh, that could not quite keep up, so we added a second melter. The advantages we see with the Strico melt system is the melt efficiency is very good. Uh, and we find that the metal is cleaner with less dross loss using the stack melter concept. Uh, we, have, uh, we have added the second stack melter in order to keep up with our growing book of business. And the people on the floor really like it. Before we got the Strico, we had one very large 46,000 pound reverb furnace to use uh, to supply all of our metal. And, uh, and that furnace took up a lot of floor space. The two stack melters we have utilize significantly less floor space, but do require a lot more discipline when melting metal because you've got to always be there when the, uh, or be ready when the furnace is calling for, for uh, more metal to be added. Uh, we do utilize uh, a lot of uh, thin walls in our castings, and that's what's really pushed that, pushed that down in size. In fact, about one-third of our metal that we introduce into the furnace is, uh, is uh, uh, raw ingot. Two-thirds is remelt because of the thin walls that we use in our die castings. Uh, so that's an overview of, of the melting technology that we're using today. Uh, we have been pleased with the technology from Strico. We've purchased both of our Strico melters used and, uh, and had to do rebuilds of those. And we're actually in the process of bringing in a third used Strico. But in our North Carolina plant, we recently purchased a new Strico uh, stack melter that will be delivered in August of this year. We currently get for melt efficiency approximately a thousand uh, we utilize about a thousand BTUs per, per pound melted and uh, that's an approximation but that is down significantly from what our our previous reverb furnace uh, experience low gas low natural gas prices have have helped keep our costs down but we do expect that over time those costs will go up and the advantage of the streetco will just be that much more significant with higher natural gas prices. 